What did you not agree with? Okay, so start from the beginning with... Bro, I listen to the stream. That, that's what I'm saying. Start from the beginning, and I'll tell you what I disagree with. What, do you hear the stream? Bro, are you listening to the stream or to, to, to the app? Oh, okay, it's fixed. Okay. Oh, Jesus no. Christ. Oh You're my good. God, bro. Okay, we're good. Okay, what do you want? 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 How did, how did you not agree? What did you not agree with? I, I, I don't get it. Say it. Okay, so go on. Tell your take again. Bro! You have a stream delay for no reason when I'm using the fucking app itself. How are you so scuffed? Okay, listen. Oh, it's working. It's working. Okay, good. Oh, well, no shit! It. Okay. Game. Game. Yo. My bad. Okay, it's a simple, it's a simple concept. Okay. There is a, there is a difference. There is a, 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 a big distinction between somebody being sexualized without their consent and when content that they make is not meant to be sexualized, is sexualized against their will, right? And them having OnlyFans or Fansly or Fan House, right? And posting sexual content to be consumed in a sexual way. There's a difference between the two things. Between the two things. Okay. So, but I don't think that's what chat was arguing about. It is. I think, it, it I think, is, yeah. Because I saw most of chat, they were arguing, saying that it's more hypocritical Do you understand? It's more yeah, yeah. hypocritical. So, thing. so, I the clip describes exactly what I just said, and three quarters never the chat was against me on that, right? That's what the debate. That's what the debate. The debate started. This right here, the clip states the opposite of what you said. He mixes up consent and not consent, pretty much. It shows against me. Okay. Um, I think the clip was titled wrong. I think chat is still arguing with the whole the whole old point of that spend for the like, last week that's been going on. Huh? What do you mean? Huh? What, 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 bro, what are you even watching? What, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? The... Our, dude, the point! Are, bro, are you lost? Yeah, a little bit. How is it bigger? Is it bigger? Okay, you don't even know what the fuck we're talking about. Yes, X. Okay, listen, listen, listen. Okay, yeah, then give me, give me the other point then. Give me, give me whatever point, okay. whatever point you were talking about then. Whatever else we were talking about. I then. think, I think chat is still <laughs> arguing. Don't, with... don't hide behind chat. Do not hide behind chat. Don't, don't fucking do that. No, shit. no, 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 no. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Just because there's a difference between between the two, they are still both wrong to promote. That is what chat's trying to say. Yes, there's a difference, but there's still both. Twitch is full of children. So why are they promoting a site that is mostly porn based? That's what, so yes, both are wrong. But what Chad is trying to say is that they're still promoting porn to children. Okay, so this is, this this is, is an good. argument that is pushed across the board, across a lot of topics, right? And I'm very honest with you, it's, a very, it's what we call uh, in, in argumentative dialogue, um, a low hanging fruit. It's that it's very easy to, 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 to go towards and to get free points and look like you're the one that's virtuous and right about. Right? So where do you draw the line? Right? Where well, where they're both wrong. Okay, no, no, wait, wait. Where do you draw the line, right? When something's promoted to children or not? Where do you, where do you draw the line? Wait, uh, repeat that again? Where do you draw the line when something is promoted to children or intended to promote to children and not? When when is it start? When is it when does it end? Because as far as I'm concerned, right? People have uh, streams that are 18 plus, right? Okay. They use platforms that are 18 plus, and to access the content, it's 18 plus, right? So there's like a, 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 a like an age to it, right? So 18 plus yeah. is like the safeguard in that way. If you use all the safeguards that are possible for you to use as a creator, right, at your disposal, then how can you say that it's meant for children? Okay. First. Okay, no, no, oh, oh. They're, they're you, now, now, now you're, you're, reading, you're reading the chat. Chat says no, no, the no. website is 20 plus. Okay, so when you would go back in the days to Blockbuster, that, right? That's not what I'm saying. The, when you went to Blockbuster as a kid, you go to the, you'd go to the space, and, and it's family friendly zone, right? And the zone with like a little, little, with a little drape, and all the porn movies were behind the drape, and all of those were 18 plus, right? The safeguard is 18 plus barrier. You don't go there when you're a fucking child. End of story. 
right? Now, go ahead, say your point. Okay, so the first first thing is, I agree with you on the point where, one, it shouldn't be Twitch's responsibility. One, it's the fucking parents' fault. If the kid is stupid, and one uh, streamer should not be a kid's fucking, uh, you should not be looking up the streamers. That's idiotic. It's the parents' fault. The parents there, then the parent. It's first, idiot's fault. For, but second, I have a question. Is, is Twitch a gaming platform? Or is it an entertainment platform? Nope. Is it still a gaming platform? Not, not even close to being gaming. Not even close. It, th- that was the original idea for Twitch, was the whole gaming thing. And now, uh, yeah, but they, they, they lost their identity, that identity like fucking like six years ago. Exactly. So, one, I think regardless across all boards, even if it says 18 plus, they, uh, when you did your poll, a majority of your chatters were children under 18. So why are they promoting? What, and what they're poll? like liberating cuties. Um, Bro, 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 my chest average age is 20. I'm talking Ludwig and Cutie's fan base are way younger than yours. And they're promote they're still promoting the porn. That is where chat has a problem. I'm not saying I hundred so like my logs when I told you, I will defend chat and I will agree with chat. Wait, wait, You're- wait, 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 wait. The porn. What's fucking porn? Oh the them promoting OnlyFans and Fansly. That's porn. That's a literal porn. Oh, 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 I mean, I mean, I see it. There's another kind of like low hanging fruit. The reality is that I understand that these platforms are meant to be used. Tim, these platforms are meant well, to be used. That's what Chat was talking in... about, and you're getting mad about. These platforms, I mean, you're partially correct. Partially correct. Right? Uh, it's, it's, it is low hanging fruit because that's not what the platforms are for. It's how a lot of it is used, right? But okay. does that, does that, people, people that do, Use Fansly in a in a way that's sexual, right? Well, they have, they have all all the all, all the safeguards. Uh, people have to make an account. People have to make an account and, and verification or whatever. That they're doing plus, right? Okay. You understand that reason, that? But I think the thing is, safeguards don't protect shit. One of safeguards than anything. I mean, look at the whole stake thing. Okay. So so what can you do then? then? That's a cop out. I think safeguards are a cop out. It's like, oh look, I copped out. I put an eighteen plus, so I'm okay. Whatever happens. It so, happens. so in the, in the, in this instance, then you could you you could equate this one to one to going to the owner of Blockbuster or uh, your local fucking uh, back in the days your 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 video uh, uh, movie dealer or whatever, right? And and tell them, tell them that um there are safeguards for uh, eighteen plus content uh, or porn section is useless and irrelevant and they're responsible for promoting uh, pornographic material in a place where uh, of all ages people can go into because the whole the whole building is for whatever plus right so their safeguards are bad how's that how is that any different tell me hold on chat let me let him let him go let him go um i think the main so like one like again i'm defending chat with it i think the big problem chat has is now they're normalizing it which is the big issue. They're they're taking it there and they're putting it over here. And they're normalizing this this fansly and only fans and it dude, like I'm not calling anyone out. And also Blockbuster doesn't plaster those type of ads on their window. Blockbuster isn't saying, Hey, come here, look, we have porn, like come to porn. They're they're plastering movies because they're a movie thing. Like that was just a small part of it. And Blockbuster's dead. You can't find porn on Netflix anymore. That's the main one. That that was old, but this is like now. See, 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 see. That that that, that is really a fair argument. And they though. ID'd. They ID'd then. Like you got ID'd then. When okay, you so, would buy a T-rated game, you would yes, have to have your parents yes, there. But unfortunately, online is a whole different ball game. I mean, you can go anywhere you want on the internet. You, you can go to Pornhub when you're whatever age. I mean, I used to go to I I, I used to go on on adult site when I uh, when I was young. I mean, it is what it is. I mean, what 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 are the safeguards you think would be acceptable? Otherwise, otherwise, the reality is, what you're saying right now, is that otherwise, there's no way you should have any adult material on here anywhere, because it's accessible. Yeah, That's it. Um, so, no, I agree it's, with I, you I, there. Th- I, think it's a, it's I think it's a utopian. I think it's, I That's think... why I said I agree with you on the point that it's the parents. It's the parents. Uh, overall, it's at the end of the day, ends with the parents. Because if you're not, if you're letting your kid watch, you know, a booba streamer with big melons out that are all oiled up, it's... It's their, it's the parents' fault. Yeah. So. But they're also normalizing that, promoting these fans' leads and promoting these OnlyFans and getting all these sponsors. And I'm not saying that's wrong. 
But Twitch needs to draw a line. I think that's another issue is Twitch does not have clear QoS. It is they need to draw the line somewhere. Either full send it, let boobies out, let ass out, let all of it fucking spread. Sorry for cursing, uh, spreading it out. But uh, or have a clear cut so line and say I none at all. I think Twitch banned um, direct to link and sponsors of OnlyFans. Because the site, I think the site wide as a whole, I think it was 18 plus, I think it's why. But Fansly is used as a Patreon, right? For a lot of people. Okay. I think even even Juice the show, they had like a, their own thing uh, 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 with it. Where it was like non, it was like non um, 18 plus content, right? So people say question mark, but they're wrong. A lot, a lot of people used, a lot of people use Fansly as non 18 plus content. That's it. it, it it's meant for both the same way on uh, that on Twitch you have sections that are like normal and more normal content and more like 18 plus content slash like fucking like a uh, pool and whatnot. Okay. Um, and then another thing on top of that, of what a lot of people in chat were saying was she was talking about um, objectifying women and all that, but those platforms in itself are like literally making women more of property. Like think just, just think well, no, 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 how... no, not the platform. Oh, wait, hold on. Before you go further, it's the platform that's objectifying it. It's the girls that are objectifying themselves. Yes. So now, now think of it this way. From now, we go back to the children aspect. Think of how this is going to affect five years from now, where you have these 18... Like, think about kids in school now. When all they see is their favorite streamers. Oh, sex sells, sex sells, sex sells. All this stuff. All these girls in high school now, all these dudes, all, all these like kids, because they're kids, they're dumb... They're going to be looking like, oh, the the women are like devalued now. This this is yeah, yeah. I said uh, truth and reality. You're, you and are... think of like, so think of the hot tub streamers and how all these hot tub streaming is allowed. What happens if a sixteen year old girl does what the big hot tub streams? Wait, are they going to automatically ban it, bro? If it's not sexual, okay. what happens if a sixteen year old does it? I I literally agree with you. This this yeah, is well, we're point. the point. I'm sorry. Well, I mean, point. yeah, because you ventured off the point, right? The the point is the practice. Not, 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 not the, the, the industry as a whole. It's not even the back pedal. I've always, I've always said this. I've always said this. And guys, you need to realize that this is not the point of the argument and we're straying away. And yeah, this, looks like, this looks like a win. It, it, it also looks like me, I'm backpedaling, but I've always agreed with this. You guys are, you guys are just being dumb as fuck. No, he, he's not backpedaling, Chad. He's cooking me. I promise. You guys are saying like, guys. If we're, if we're on a very fi fine line of, co of Sarah, co consent talk... Try? Who the fuck is he talking to? Sorry, my, I was talking to my girlfriend. Okay, he's schizo. Anyway. Um, anyway, anyway, anyway. See, 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 the thing is, the thing is, is that... Fortunately, or unfortunately, okay, the way the, this world works is that girls are allowed to objectify themselves. Sex workers, whether you agree with it or not, they, they are allowed to want their material to be sexualized and post pictures of them naked to be consumed if they want to, right? That's kind of like, that's kinda, it's, it's what they choose to, you know? I, but okay. I agree with it or not, they'll do it and they have the right to, right? But saying that the platform uh, uh, sexualizes them or objectifies them is just wrong. I think it's more common for girls to sexualize themselves and uh, uh, use themselves to... Uh, uh, in an objectifying way for people to consume, right? At, at higher rates. I do think there's problems behind that. I think, I think that there, that there's a big society problems behind some of these things, right? But I think that's beside the point, right? Okay. Yeah, uh, I can see where, where I, you I, that. I think, I think, yeah. Well, I don't like the argument of pushing things onto children. I think, I think, I think you can see how it's a dis disingenuous and a little bit an argument we call in bad faith. I think I think it's in bad faith. Okay. Yeah. No. I I 100% see what you mean by there. But once again, going back to it, like, so chat was technically right. Like that that was the whole point. That's what they were pushing. I think you just read it wrong. And then you have the idiots. You got one guy. Well, not really, because I started get, okay. I started getting some. I watched a clip. I said it's about consent, and people said it. Pure answer. LA take, dumb fuck, and I had said nothing else but consent at that point. I started, I started picking people from chat, and those start arguing, and then I had to pick more people to argue. Now you guys are arguing the points that we're being delayed about, 
And it was our chat, but completely dodging the initial reason why we started this argument in the first place. The argument in the first place was entirely about consent. The only reason why they started was about consent. You can watch, you can watch the VOD. Go back. Go back. Go, if you're going to watch, I, I said, debate me as we're having a take purely about consent and only about consent. Okay. So, yeah. I agree there, but it's if it was that much of a deal, they're still pushing it to children, which is where that shit will... Children are dumb. They they don't understand okay. consent okay. in that ways. Okay. So okay. that's why that stuff's getting used. Okay. Them pushing it and plastering it everywhere that long, that's what got it more famous. I didn't hear it from Atriok. I didn't even know who the fuck Atriok was. I saw the clip of her on the podcast with Hassan and everyone. That was what really blew it up. I, I didn't know. I wasn't going to go look at the millisecond thing that Atriok showed. Like, that was only very few. So, it was when everyone started blowing it up and pushing that drama, and yeah, they got yeah. the views from it. So in a perfect world, I would assume that the way to deal with this, right? Atriot, nobody should have said shit about it. Should have been dragged under the rug, and things should have been dealt with behind closed doors. Because everybody going crazy about it, promoted it to insane lengths, right? That further uh, uh, made the problem more, more out there, uh, uh, publicized it. People, I'm pretty sure 95% of people, 98% of people that had no idea about that, that, that this content was even out there. And now they knew and were actively looking for it. So this should have been put under the rug. This is called a world, that's, called, uh, that's in, uh, a utopia. In, in the world, that does, that does not happen like that. It, it, that this, in, in the real world, we, things don't work like this. It's a very big problem, uh, actually, with uh, uh, a lot of things with, with, uh, with uh, uh, the media. Uh, uh, shootings, shootings. Big problem with that, same problem. It's it, uh, yeah. the way it's publicized, the way it's displayed, right? Furthers the it, problem. It also not. brings more shooters because so, they they, yes. they see the fame and they love it. Yes, it's been studied. It's been studied for decades. It's it's been it's been it's been uh, proven. Top scientists and psychologists have, have talked about this. Uh, uh, the way that that shootings are reported are an insane fucking uh, uh, fuel to the fire, dog shit. Whatever though, whatever though. Hold on. One more thing, one more thing. How do you fix it? Give me a solution. Don't no, no, be so no, 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 no. Give me a solution. Okay, no. You, no, no. You brought, national, you brought, you brought an initial problem. I'll tell you. What, okay. National television. They have ads of beer, cigarettes, casinos that are on national television. That are, TVs are playing everywhere. Every TV is playing it. Children are around. Children see that. Yes, they do. They do have ads like that. They, they do, 100%. So can you, can you say, well, I think these, these companies are targeting children. Wait, who has ads like that? Um, national television. Or like uh, alcohol or whatever. Any. So like, okay, football, you know, like NFL, there we go. Anything, anything, right? It's all out there, right? You can make this as an argument that they are pushing these 18 plus products on children, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's the same, it's the same thing. Yeah. But it's a problem. But you can't buy those products if you're under 18. They ID. So how do you make an equivalent of that safeguard in real life to that safeguard online? By not letting creators push it. By Twitch banning people when they're when they're promoting OnlyFans and and Fansly, like these, like the certain. Sh and I'm first off, I'm not against it. Like that's what I'm saying. Whether it's but, they need to have a clear line in the TOS instead of somebody, these female streamers spamming their links of their websites and you, it's literally one click. A, a, a 14 year old kid could click on the link and now they see boobs, big butt, oil. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. So what you're saying is that if um, there's a girl and her name is uh, a, a Pearl and Pearl, uh, if you Google her, right? She's famous on, on, on OnlyFans or whatever, right? If you, you Google, will see it on Google. If you, if you Google it, yeah, you, you, should, you should be able to, yeah. Uh, uh, whatever. If you, if you see her, her OnlyFans, then, then it's, it, um, all you need is to click 18 plus being my, being my mom, right? Okay. Right? Uh, Google has a safeguard in the natural thing. So if I type in like boob, it, unless my safeguard filters off, it's, it's going to hide as much as it can. Oh, but it says, it says 18 plus filter is on. We don't want to turn it off. So you're saying that people that are not 18 cannot click the button? 
Oh well, yeah, they can. Well, that's oh, the they, problem. No, they can. But that's the that's what I'm trying to say. So oh, how does Twitch stop that? So you by agree? With it. You agree? That safeguards are trash. And oh, then, uh, then, yeah, that's what I said at first. Safeguards are cop out. So there's that's no. So there's, no, so, so there's no solutions. Well, Twitch can have a solution. They ban it off their platform and say no. If somebody's promoting links directly in their chat, a, a streamer spamming, this is my link. Go click it, and I just click once, and now oh, yo, yo, yo. Oh. we have an issue, and then you get distracted for ten minutes. I, I think I think that people are getting sidetracked on the fact that um, uh, uh, um, the safeguards are shit. It is an industry problem. It's a problem across the board, right? Ha if there's no solution, then what can you do? Wait, so now you're saying that safeguards don't work. Weren't you the one saying that there's safeguards for a reason? Well, no, 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 no. I'm saying safeguards exist, right? But I'm agreeing with you that safeguards... I guess don't, they don't they don't really work, right? You said yeah, they don't really work. Yeah, no, they don't work. Sure, they, it's just a cop out. Well, it's not really a cop out. It's not, it's not, it's not really a cop out. It's just that well, it's the best you can do. Uh, I mean, you just not do it at all. Twitch could you know toughen down on it. Okay. Um. I, I I don't know that it's still that we're going circles. There's not, there's not, there's not there's yeah, yeah, no, we we, we found some much, common. There's not much to argue. I mean, I'm kind of, I'm, 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 I'm just kind of upset that um, this whole decision about consent was the, the, the main point, and now you guys made it like about like this, this, this like um, promoting fansly type shit. I don't I don't really understand. Yeah, well, let's you know, let's chat. It's a, uh, I think. Chat and you both interpreted it wrong because I came here to defend chat and. And most well, of the I mean, stuff I saw wasn't I, I, them I, I, saying, defending I'll, it against I'll, I'll, consent. I'll look at the VOD again. I chat, guys, yeah, yeah, just look at the VOD. Nah, it's just kind of annoying. It's, it's gonna, because um, if you look at the VOD, the whole thing was about consent and it was at LA taken. So, I mean, it, it, if things got lost in communication and we, we had to find a new topic to talk about, I mean, sure, I don't, I don't mind, but it's just how it is. I, okay. You just changed me the Yeah, so, so uh, you had the problem with, you know, Coil calling her a hypocrite. But it, it is sort of hypocritical because family does contribute to the objection objectifying a woman. Like that that's no the whole they don't main contribute. Point. The girls contribute. Stop blaming the fucking platforms. If people want to Yeah, yeah, well that's what I'm saying. The girls are still pushing it. All of them are pushing it. She was pushing Fansley when the bear getting objectified because of it. Then the so like, then the difference here is consent, whether they want to be socialized or not. They are, they are promoting people that want to be sexualized and are socializing, socializing themselves, right? As people who don't sexualize themselves. There's nothing hypocritical about that. Yeah, no, that's a better way to put it. No, you're right. Yeah, even, that, even, that's even, a better way to even though, it. Even though the person w w was sexualized against their consent, right? They were still allowed, without being a hypocrite, to promote a platform with sexual content of sexualized people if they, these people on there want to sexualize themselves. It doesn't make them a hypocrite whatsoever. It's not science. It's not hypocrite at all. Um, uh, no, it definitely is. Oh wow! It, it, because they're still pushing the the. They're still. Uh, okay, hold on. Wait, say that again. I, I think I heard you wrong. Say it one more time. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm saying it. Somebody who is sexualized against their consent can still go okay. on and promote a platform where creators are sexualized because the creators sexualize themselves with consent. Okay. That does not make this person a hypocrite for promoting that platform. Um, so it does because it's, so it's, hold on, let me do one of your analogies. So it's like saying, it's like me getting slapped in the knee, right? I'm like, oh, I don't like that because you're doing it. But I want this person to slap me in the knee. So you're, it, it's, it's like, how are you going to push against sexualization of women when you're, no, nope. when nope. you're going to say, I understand the other side, I understand the consent thing. Yes, that's wrong. That is 100% wrong. Don't think I'm, I'm like saying it, but I can see where Claude is coming them. from saying it's hypocritical. I will simplify it for you, okay? Okay. This, okay. okay. This is Joe Rogan. Oh, I, I got it. Hold on. I got to go. Okay. Now I see. Okay. It. This is Joe Rogan. You, know, you see Joe Rogan? This is Joe okay. Rogan. Okay. And Fantasy doesn't have a lot of safeguards. That's that's another thing. Some guy it, it is just open. Bro, some guy pulls up, okay, and he punches Joe Rogan in the fucking face. Right? Out, out on the street, right? Comes up, 
and he punches Rin, right in his fucking jowl. Bing! And he's like, yo, what the fuck? I'm gonna sue this fucking motherfucker, right? So then, she, she sues the guy who punches him. He's like, yo, why'd you punch me? And then, Joe goes on, next day, after his lawsuit, and he goes on and promotes UFC, where people punch each other, right? With consent. Is Joe okay. a hypocrite or not? Uh, I don't think it's the same at all. How is not the same? Tell me how it's not the same. So, so in this instance, in this instance, Cutie, Cutie, uh, 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 okay, was sexualized okay. against her consent, and then there's okay. a lawsuit, and then she promoted uh, a, a website where where people creators uh, sexualize themselves with consent. It is a one-to-one -one analogy. How does that make her a, uh, a, a hypocrite? How? Uh, you sort of lost me. Okay. So the argument is fantastic. Um, I think the analogy is great. Chat's being done. Okay. So listen. Uh, 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 I'll call this fans like it. So the equi here's the equivalency. It's, it's, I, I, it's an equivalency because it's, it's almost the same thing, right? So basically, so, so, uh, Joe Rogan is physically assaulted, right? Okay. Which is a crime, against his consent on the street. Then he sues the person. There's a lawsuit, right? And then, next day, he goes on and promotes UFC, which is, which is a, a platform where people assault each other, right? You agree with that? Okay. I with think the more issue was that she was normalizing it, pushing that, though. Uh, no, wait. But they agree, they consent to punching and being punched. That is black on white. It's a sport, it doesn't matter. Uh, that, that is completely irrelevant. They still consent to being punched, yes or no? Yes. Okay, so then, Judy was sexualized against her consent, right? Then, I believe they, they, sued, people that, they, they sued people who did it. Then, they, they promoted OnlyFans or, or Fansly. Where people sexualize themselves, but with consent. It's a one-on-one -on -one argument. Is Joe a hypocrite? Is he a hypocrite? No. But I don't think that contributes to the original point with what Chat was saying. It's because she Do had such a problem you, Just... with these females being sexualized. But she was still supporting a platform that sexualizes women. I understand what you mean by oh, but they're consenting the to be sexualized. The platform does but... not sexualize them. They sexualize themselves. The platform makes content behind paywall. That's all it does. Fansly, Fansly, okay. And it children is... can't take part in the MMA. That's another. That that's another big thing. That was it. It was children. You have to remember we're talking about like. Children, is made most children. children can punch, and when I, when I was a young, when I was young with my with my friends, we had a UFC ring in my friend's basement. He was rich, he had a basement, and we had our, our own UFC ring. We would punch it like crazy. Yep. This is fake story number three hundred. It is true. It is true. It is true. And we got. Oh, who won? I would always lose, but I mean, it doesn't matter. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But we understand. I, yeah. Okay. So well, Fansly is a place. Okay, I had to promote it. Okay, okay, fuck fan. First of all, uh, Fansly, whatever. I don't give a fuck about Fansly. Okay. They do, all they do is they paywall content. Sexual, sometimes. Non sexual, also. But it's a paywall, right? Saying that they sexualize people is completely disingenuous. Okay, but it's used mainly for sexualizing material. The people. Sexualize themselves on it, and then yes, people but they're consume. getting the, those people at platform. Um, okay, that will always have a platform. That the market for sex work is gigantic. The amount of views that that the shit gets yeah. on porn almost is colossal. A the biggest part of the internet in terms of of content is porn. Regardless, it is not. Yeah. It's not. It's not fucking. It's not X Y Z on the internet. The biggest one topic thing uh, is porn. So, this is yeah, yeah. so you're right there, right? You were right there. But what chat was saying was 
um, the promote them promoting it is all it's gonna them promoting this is gonna result in more uh, streamers being sexualized without consent because it's opening more these children the more brand rise this. Ooh, that is okay. Now, now you're doing an argument. It's like victim blaming a little bit. I think it's a bit of a reach. Yeah. But uh, uh, but on the first thing, so all behind that, I don't. So I don't think it should. Regardless, if she felt okay. uncomfortable with it, she's a hundred percent right. Because okay, you have okay. to take her feelings. So, you're, so, so you're saying That's that. The first thing. So you're saying that like this is this argument is saying that. Promoting safe sex is the same as promoting just sex overall. And, and you're, you're, you're contributing to the problem of unsafe sex because you promote safe sex. What? What are you saying? Uh, uh, another, another equivalent analogy then. So what you're saying is that if you promote safe sex, you also, by default, promote unsafe sex as a, as a collateral. Well, you're still promoting sex. Right. Okay. And uh, porn ruins people's lives. Like that's a serious issue. It's 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 a little bit of a of a um, of a uh, how do you call this? It's um I I don't even know, I don't know how to explain this. It's um it's like one of these things where like. You're right about nothing. It's kind of like yeah, I agree. it's kind of like um, okay, right? Because why not? It it it, it is true. You're you're yeah. right about nothing. Like like what are you right about? Is that but you're saying that by by promoting by by promoting consensual sexualization, you're promoting non-consensual. Sexualization. I I don't know how that makes any sense. It doesn't make sense. It's it's kind of like it's like uh, okay, I guess. I, I mean, I guess you're right. Uh, or not. Uh. Well, I don't know anymore. Let me. I mean, we were. So, well, I'm uh, lost. Uh, so what you're saying is that yes, yes. That it. Stop misconstruing what I'm saying. You don't understand what I'm talking about. What you're saying is that by promoting consensual sexualization. You are also promoting non-consensual sexualization. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, so you're saying, no, so you're no, saying. No, no. But, but you're not helping the non-consensual part. But yes, they are. They sued them. You're opening up a whole new can of women being ejectified now. They sued them. They took them down. Hmm? The, oh. pe the people that are doing... The, 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 the company that was doing non-consensual shit, they got sued. They got taken down. Yeah, they could have sued them before all of this, before the whole HR thing, they, they... Well, there was a spike of interest because of the whole, the whole saga. So then they did go after them, right? Okay, yeah. Um, I guess you could say that uh, she's not a hypocrite with it, but she's still contributing. She, that part is where she's still contributing to the objectification and sexualization of women. Especially the children, because you got to remember this is all coming back. So the reason chat had an, a problem was because these are children well, that on her ad was saying adult content fair. to children. Audience. So at that point, you are you are uh, 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 you're you're just this is a, and a, like an anti-sex work pretty much uh, take then, right? You don't you just don't like. Um, no, no, no. I could care less. I'm defending chat. I can see where chat's coming from. Uh, I'm I'm a, see. You're not a real centrist. I'm a real centrist. So I can look at both sides and get the both of like and see both sides and understand each one. Okay, so you, you're pushing. That's a low hanging fruit. You're, you're pushing disingenuous arg arguments that you don't understand what the root. Uh, so whenever you get something to debate with, you want, I want to know your argument, but where does it come from? What's we'll the behind it? If every time that we go to the nature of your argument, you say, "Well, it's chats." I don't know. I don't know what this is. The argument, right? Then we can't get to fixing it or finding a solution because we cannot find the root nature of the argument. It doesn't make sense. It's not how you debate anybody. It's not, it's not how you may have the discussion. Okay. Yeah. Well, what chat was saying was that they believe it's hypocritical because even though it is for their consent, it's still sexualizing and objectifying women to children. That was their main problem. Oh. That was the main issue. I think no one can win here. No one can so, win here. Okay, yeah. So th this comes to the fact that they just don't like. See, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to say how it is. Again, 
I will sound like, like some blue-haired virtue signaler, okay? Uh, um, I think people like to consume and 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 and, and juice up from uh, uh, centralized content and also make them feel bad for doing it because they gain from it. They want to like diminish them for gaining money from it and, and having that as, as a plus, but they also consume at the same time, which I think that is super critical. Okay. Yeah, I agree with you. I agree. Um, that is it. That that is it. So, the the real uh, guys, guys. I wish you guys understood it. Okay, this whole thing is about. It's coming down to a fact whether you, whether you agree with it or not. That that fans, the only fans, are a thing. The problem with yeah. them, the themselves. I don't think the problem should be advertised. The problem on Twitch. Well, 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 then if it's not on Twitch, then, then it should be advertised anywhere. That's a different argument too, because now you're going on Twitch TOS, and that's not the original. Well, well argument. no, no, no. Well, I, I, I do agree with you though. I, I don't think it should be. I don't think. I, I don't think it should be promoted anywhere. But this has. That, that's what the landscape is. Well, that, I think that, it, that, that is what the landscape I is. I think it needs to be clear. It's either let the boobies and the big ass and oiled up and the the, the stickers on the nipples like allow or don't allow it at all. Instead of you getting banned for showing an ass crack, you know what? You're right. Okay, that that is that is uh, consistent with TOS. But that's, that's a whole different argument. So that's yeah. what I think. This opened up the chat, um, talking about other stuff, I, and then they threw that into this argument. Then, then I have. Uh, I, I didn't want to go there, okay? But I have a little bit of the kryptonite to your, all your arguments. Then you, um, then you don't agree with, with Patreon. Then, hmm? then, then you do not. You don't agree with Patreon. Is that correct? What do you mean? Why do you agree, agree with that? Patreon or not? What about Patreon? I don't understand. Do saying. you agree with it being, being being promoted or used as a, as a way to make money and, and, and used uh, on Twitch or not? Patreon? Yeah. Uh, well, as long as it's not getting pushed for something illegal towards children or anything bad, yeah, then do what you want. Well, I mean, you can't pick and choose here. Well, that was the whole ar basis of the argument. No, no, no. Well, you can't pick and choose here. Okay, Patreon is a paywall platform. Fansly is a paywall platform. That's it. Sometimes you sexually, sometimes not. Um, I think Patreon has uh, stuff on it. I'm pretty sure his Patreon goes out there, isn't it? Not. Oh, uh, I think, I think, but that that argument doesn't really work because Patreon isn't pushed for that. Fansly is pushed for sexual content. That, that's a very far reach. So, oh, uh, so now now you're arguing it, how how it's used mostly, not not if it can happen. happen well, yeah, that's the majority thing. I'm not gonna if there's porn on Twitter, but I'm not gonna try to sell my porn on Twitter. I'm gonna try to sell it on OnlyFans because that's the main concept right here. But that that's a whole different thing. We're still talking. So I think what happened with with Y Chat and everyone was being dumb was I wish I had a paper so I could draw, but. Uh, your yeah, shirt okay. game okay. has gone up recently. So it's like this, the drip. ready? So here was the main argument, right? Here was chat's argument, and here was your argument. So this was the main one. I think what, and here's other arguments. So like, oh, you know, bo big boogie shouldn't be allowed in Twitch and all that. I think chat was taking some arguments in here and stocking it in here as well. So now it was a bunch of arguments. So now they were, they, oh, it was like the, um, how, you talk about how Andrew Tate says a bunch of good stuff, and then he says a little bit of bullshit, and he throws it in. I think that's what chat was doing, was chat was like saying, oh, well, this shouldn't be allowed, and TOS needs to be clear, and yeah, she's a hypocrite. So I think it was just a bunch that's of because out. That's because th these topics have a lot of very easy uh, way ways out, right? You can get a, you can get a whole topic, and it, it can be very, very, uh, uh, have a fine lines of what is wrong, what is not wrong, and you can always go back to some really shitty argument, bullshit, and default to it, and everybody's going to agree. And then you're getting sidetracked. Now, now if you don't agree, you're backtracking. It's, 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 it's just dog shit, right? When the main point was about consent, that's it. And I don't think it makes you a hypocrite to, to promote um, consensual stuff, even though you're against non-consensual things. That, that's it. That's the basis of it. That is the basis of it. Although Pepsi okay. is disgusting. I don't know what's your problem. It's a water. It's not Pepsi. Disgusting. I went bowling and I got a water. It's well, you're promoting caffeine. 
Um, I don't drink caffeine. Children, oh, no. and that hinders the development what is that? at a young age. What is that? And they can die. They can die. I, I think you're really doing now. Is this into us? What is that? People are dying right now. People are dying. No. That's you. People are dying because we just did now. They're actually dying. They're, they're dying. Drink water, eat healthier, and your sleep will get better. You sleeping good? Uh, nope. Why not? Is it because you eat fast food and drink? Why don't you hire a chef? Because I ate your mother. That's why. Dude, I don't oh, have a mom. Well, okay. All right. Check my the guess. Damn. Jesus, bro. That, that was gonna fly. Uh, so we done? Um, what are you doing today? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. We done. After that, I'm getting back. I got, I got, I got the wall set up. Uh, listen, listen, listen. I think, I think, I think, I wish you understood it, that um, consent across the board is important, regardless of anything. Yeah, no, no. You're I, a that's, person that that's message. massive. That's a hundred percent, yes. I do think though. I'm a lover of women. In a I'm perfect lover of boobs. In a, in a perfect butt. world, I do agree though that sexualized stuff or whatever um, shouldn't shouldn't be it shouldn't be anywhere. Okay, I I I agree with the gamma thing, to be honest. But that that's just a reality that is that is out there. And I think um, we're about to hit the cusp of a, a social apocalypse. Okay. Well, but. it's either, well, the whole issue is make more rules about it. Either allow it or don't allow it at all. Like the whole GABA thing, how like, imagine if you and Train were streaming on that news, that shit would be banned tomorrow. Like Instantly to done if to you guys are streaming on that other website. Sex. And now no one cares. Well, what is this? Like, what is this? We have these soccer players. If Tom Brady comes in and wants to gamble, they're not going to ban it. But if you and Train does it, boom, done. So, yes, so that goes up. You need to make more strict rules. Why, imagine if you did hot tub streams, having your juicer hanging out in a Speedo, you'd be banned. Because, uh, listen, this is the same problem with the gamble thing, okay? People come and make the argument the strongest against the topic, right? And they will use morality, right? They use morality. You shouldn't be doing this because this. And then something happens, like something gets banned or whatever, right? And then you're like, well, what about this? And then the argument falls back to legality, right? So like safeguards and 18 plus whatever, right? Right? It, it, it's always like this. It's always like this, right? Because it's just, it's the easy way to do it. When in fact, they're wrong. They are wrong. It, they, they, they start from morality, then they back themselves up into legality, always. And it's, it's disingenuous. If your argument was good from the get-go, if you had a point about morality, you would win your point right there. You wouldn't have to fall back to some bullshit legality. You would not have to. You wouldn't have to. Because the problem with gambling, okay, is the root behavior. And that root behavior, you are delusional. I'm not trying to act woke. It is ingrained in your system. It is in your brain from a very young age. Sometimes six, seven-year-old. You, you have gambling patterns built in that develop through various mechanics and social media and products you interact with on a daily. You, you become a gambler before you Pokemon gambled cards. on a legal Pokemon term. Pokemon cards were the original gambling. You yes, I know. It. Yeah, I know. But chat won't listen to this. Okay. The, the, listen. Pack opening on FIFA is worse than slots gamba. I just, I said it. I said it. I don't give a fuck what people think about this. Well, that's because it's normalized. It is. It is heavily target children, and it's also much more accessible sometimes with simple two or three thumb clicks on an iPad with their mom's credit card, and it builds that behavior because it empowers that root behavior, that root thoughts. The behavior of gambling is now being being fueled super hard, the same way that that, that thoughts would, but it's less less, less accessible. So, I don't know what people think if this is not true. I don't think they have a problem with the slots. And this is going to be a hot take. I think they have a problem with who's doing the slots. And that's the issue. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I mean, that's just, yeah, yeah, true. All right, well, then we'll get on that then. I, I think this was a good argument. I, I'm going to be honest with you. I know you're kind of dumbfuck at first. I think you've had pretty solid arguments. I don't think we agreed on everything. But I think the main points that you debated were pretty fair. And you, you didn't troll. That was good. That was good. Okay. So the beginning, I looked dumb. I didn't get. I had class in the morning. I'm exhausted. I was a little nervous because you know, you look really good right now. But uh, yeah, yeah, that was it. And chat looks really good, so I was happy. 
Yeah, yeah, but I, like I said, I, I wish I didn't have to like talk about other things because my, my point was about content and it's very important. Okay. Yeah, yeah. My, no, you're right. You're right. But you're in chats. Well, me, chat was viewing it different, and you need to understand that. Well, me being right doesn't make you wrong, and you being right doesn't make me wrong. It's, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just that, I, I, I think things just kind of, kind of got lost. But it was uh, this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Chat was taking it out. Yo, so two things before we go. Uh, why don't you play Stardew Valley? Shit's kind of sleeper. Bro, there's a casino in Stardew Valley. You didn't even know that, did you? Yeah, I'm playing it right now. I don't really Yeah, there's a casino. You have to get to the uh, island. Alright, well, I'm already playing right now. I'm a monitor. I'm, I'm, I'm doing turbo spins right now. Alright, and uh, since... Since you had me sit on here all this long, I'm going to ask you, um, I want you to drink a half a gallon of water today. Okay. For me. Also, also, and give also, chat 100 also, subs. Also, also, do this, do this. How is his mic so bad, Omega Lal? <laughs> Alright, man. I can get out now. Alright, uh, no, for real, take care of yourself. You, you have better. I'm... I'm Giga Chad in shape. I got a lot of muscles, but I'm hiding it. Fair enough. I'll do so, that. Take yourself. Um, I want VIP because you owe me now. Since I, I just made you look in front of the I may VIP you. To bring but also, to that content. also, and I can carry you in games. You want to play CS? I got in the audience. Come on. Okay, fair enough. This should be nice to be on the answer. You know what you should get as well? What? Bitches. I have 